boots on the ground, putting it down. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. I got something to tell you I don't think they want you to know. But I'm going to tell you anyway. It's best-selling author Mickey D with The Scoop. I want to thank you for joining me. No matter where you are in this beautiful world of ours, it's a pleasure. It's an honor to be on your electronic device. My friends, as you know, this is about your education and your entertainment. I'm not a stockbroker. I'm not a money manager. I'm not a financial advisor. I write books. I'm an author. I do deep research. My books, Make Money Online with Cannabis Stocks, where I list over 40 stocks. I also have a strategy you can use in there, any market for the rest of your life, my friends. My books, you can get the audiobook, paperback book, or the ebook on Amazon.com. Companies, we get in companies as low as we can, my friends. We boots on the ground, we do the research. That's how we're able to get in companies early on. A company like Canopy at under $3, a company like Aurora at under $50, a company like IIPR as a teenager. Yes, 17, 18, 19, yes, it's 120, 30 something dollars now. But we were in early, my friends. I'll tell you about another early stock that that if you'd have read my book, you'd have, one of my books, you'd, have, you'd, you'd know about it because I mentioned it here. But I'm gonna tell you about a, a, an old IPO that uh, I think is having a, a resurgence right now. And uh, it's a baby knockout. And it's a very good, uh, very good uh, stock. That I think you can put on your uh, watch list, my friends. Another of my books, Investing in Medical and Recreational Cannabis, Buying Before, During, or After Legalization. Uh, it's a great book with uh, some promising medical marijuana and CBD treatments, my friends. There's a lot the FDA can learn from what's going on in uh, Israel, what's going on in Africa, what's going on in other parts of the world. Hopefully they can get this together and they can approve uh, more of this, these uh, drugs and stuff than they are. Largest indoor and outdoor marijuana farms in the world is out there. You'll know exactly what's going on in some of these countries. You'll know what can grow where, when it can grow, how it can grow, where, what, what it can grow. And so that's a very, very good uh, book for you. My friends, uh, anybody, I, get out your copy. The African Marijuana Gold Mine, Richmond Old Soil Meets Wall Street. Go ahead and get your copy out. I, w- I want to show you something real quick. Uh, my friends, you have, turn to page 97. 97, the African Marijuana Gold Mine on page 97. My friends, new genetics means new possibilities. Now, mind you, this was written, what, 18 months ago or so? This was written before this company even went public. Before they even came to the market, my friends. I'm going to tell you about this. Uh, Horticulture scientists, about halfway down the page, page 97. Horticulture scientists and cannabis breeders are constantly crossing varieties to find the next big thing in weed for both recreational and medical use. Crossbreeding led to the creation of 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 the strain, Charlotte's Web. Oh my! The highest CBD strain and currently the most effective in fighting seizures. Oh! Mickey D! If I would have gotten your book, The African Marijuana Gold Mine, I would have known what companies were fighting what? What companies were fighting? I told you about the one that's fighting diabetes. See, my friends, Parts of the world, you can test, you can do things that other parts of the world can't do. In other words, us in the West, sometimes we get a little arrogant. We think we, you know, we've done it all. We, you know, we discovered America once we got there and killed everybody there. And then we said we discovered it. But anyway, that's a story for another day. But uh, there's a lot. There's a lot to learn. You know, there's a lot. There's a lot to learn, my friends. That's why Prime Monday, Prime Monday, it's a good idea. Prime Monday to order some books, my friend, because your education is number one. Talk about this for a moment right here. The uh, uh, Marijuana Today, Vanadium and Uranium Tomorrow, companies you can get in uh, early. My friends, people are still waiting for President Trump to maybe change his mind or something. I think it's a little wishful thinking at this point uh, in the game, but he has until, uh, you know, the next day or two or to delay, uh, the best thing would be a delay right now rather than just a shoot down. No, he's not going to do it. But uh, he's got so much on his plate right now. He's not really worried about, uh, you know, this uh, uh, petition, you know, 232 uh, right now. Uh, I believe the reports that uh, he's against it. Uh, Right or wrong, the stocks acted on Friday as if he were against it. So we had to take the appropriate action. Yes, I'm still holding Cam and Co. Because as the uh, uranium price goes up, it's going to do well. 
Uh, yes, Denison Mines I'm still holding because I believe that uh, it, will, uh, it will do okay in the long run. Uh, and I look to pick up additional shares on those companies in uh, Australia and those companies in, uh, uh, also in uh, Africa and Canada also. You know, there's been some big discoveries there in Canada uh, right now. I believe those companies stand to profit from a non-approval uh, of 232. So that 25% of uranium will still, or 5% or whatever, it's not going to happen, I believe, at this particular point. I hope I'm wrong. I mean, I'm, I'm with you guys. I'm with, you know, I'm with these guys that have been in the business for a long time. You know, I'm with, you know, in 2007, you know, I, I really didn't, you know, make a lot of money. And I expected to. And I got hit. Oh, well, that's the way the business goes. But marijuana today, uranium and uranium tomorrow. Uh, companies you can get into. Uh, just for a sneak peek here, uh, on page uh, 22, uh, I told you about those first two. Uh, companies, uh, third, fourth, fifth, uh, third is Australia, uh, no, no, I take that back, fourth is Canada, uh, fifth is Africa, uh, the, the sixth is Canada, so mm, concentrate on four, five, and six, the fourth, fifth, and the sixth company, leading uranium stocks for tomorrow on page 22, it's your tip for today, my friends, my friends, I want to tell you though about a company that has potential to be a game changer. Now, they just did their first commercial agreement just here in uh, 2018, just in December. So they're a young company, you know, they IPO'd in 2012 and then they did different things and they're listed on Toronto Exchange, they're listed on Over the Counter. Let me tell you about this company. It's CO2 Grow Incorporated. Now you've probably heard of them, CO2 Grow. They're a company that, uh, you know, carbon dioxide dissolved in, in the water that makes the, the uh, marijuana plants and other plants, spinach, lettuce, uh, hemp, uh, everything. It makes it grow about 25% larger and it grows faster and it's stronger. So that has been tested, the strains have been tested. Uh, uh, they use this CO2 uh, foliar spray technology. Now, it's patent pending and it can be used indoor, outdoor, uh, it, it's a poten potentially it's a it's a technology game changer. The, it, it's it's uh, been accepted pretty much. The market is accepting of it. Sure, they're signing you know confidentiality agreements with all the different companies and stuff. But the the uh, food market and the uh, you know it, it's ex they're accepting it and it's growing uh, things bigger. So uh, so far, I haven't had any fallout from. Uh, you know any of these agencies that monitor this stuff uh, it's commercially proven it's uh, scalable it's easily adaptable to the existing irrigation system that uh, that some of these farms have right now uh, like I said indoor outdoor uh, and it's you know legal cannabis has basically uh, cannab the cannabis companies uh, especially some in America and I know this for a fact they're knocking on their door and like I said, they're signing these agreements, these confidentiality agreements. They're moving. They're low key uh, management. The 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 uh, Archibalds. They they don't seem like they're outgoing, flamboyant type uh, people. Like uh, coming out like a mad man. I won't mention any any names or anything. But uh, they're low key, and companies can take a take a. a you know, a little. We like to bring these companies out. Is Toronto Stock Exchange is Grow G R O W on the over the counter? It's B L O N F, B L O N F on the over the counter. Now, uh, C O two Grow Inc. has the potential, and it's pre baby knockout right now. It's point two. Uh, it's about twenty seven cents or so USD. Twenty eight, twenty seven, twenty eight cents. Thank you, Paulette. Uh, also, we've been keeping an eye on this. I spoke with the company here. Uh, this past week, I had a good conversation with them. I believe they're on the up and up. I think things will will work out if if management can keep a uh, grip on their technology and get their licenses and get everything uh, together. They will definitely uh, have make some noise uh, in this market. And while you know while we're going through this low right now, uh, uh, not only uh, can trust bringing everybody down, but uh, the market itself is is high and. 
people are expecting uh, a little pullback here. Uh, we're getting our pullback at IIPR. We got a little pullback there, as anticipated. I told uh, uh, one of our subscribers that it was going to about 125 or so, right there. And if we can do some price in time at 125 with IIPR, we'll be okay, my friends. There's no problem with IIPR. IIPR is right there. Teenager, read the books. Read the books. Teenager, you'd have had IIPR. Look to there. They're easy reading. They're they're not even long. You can you can you just you just need the information, my friends. Let's make this. Let's try and make this uh, game as even field as possible. Because let's let's face it, Wall Street has an unfair advantage. You know that. But if we can get in early, get with these companies super duper early, like CO2 grow, keep it on our watch list. And as they get contracts and they start doing things, maybe they might be bought out. You never know, my friends. You never know. But I know you're with your family on this uh, Saturday. I want to thank you for joining me for a few minutes of the scoop. Uh, yep, Big Al, I got to give you a call. Ron, I got to call you. Uh, uh, I got to call Strip, too. Oh, I got a lot of people I got to call. Anyway, uh, you guys take care. You know I'm out here for the summer league doing my thing. And uh, at the, uh, they're all been spending some time there at the, uh, at the uh, gym there, watching these young guys jump out of the gym. Uh, uh, no change in my favorite player there, Taco Falls. Uh, he's my favorite player. So right now, out of uh, summer league, like him and uh, and Edwards, I like that new that that team. So we'll see if they can win the championship. They start today. So God bless you. Take care of yourself. Love you and take care of you and your family. I'll have some links for you at the bottom for the books uh, here in a second when I can get them up. Uh, also, uh, uh, the t-shirts, the get up, get up, get up, get up, get up t-shirts are available. Uh, thank you for uh, taking a look at those, uh, my friends. Uh, I believe the second half, we're going to be really in for a good uh, second half uh, of the year. So I'm going to put a little oil on this, uh, on my little chair here. Anyway, take care. Love you. God bless you.